Yeah, that's, uh, <laughs> that's not supposed to happen. That's not supposed to happen. <laughs> Hey everybody, <laughs> while I'm getting this silliness fixed, how is everyone doing today? Ah, T1 Glistener Elf here, back with this fun little game. This is a, I, I described it as a Zelda-like that I am trying to turn into a Souls-like. As best I can, <laughs> I'm working on it anyway. Oh goodness, and you'll, you'll see in the title, Quest for the Academy of Umbrellas, that is an achievement for using an umbrella. An actual, factual, honest-to-god umbrella for the entire playthrough. How does that work? Uh, it doesn't. Okay, it's like the standard weapon, but it deals half damage. So we're dealing half damage the whole time. Why? Well, partially because there's an achievement, but partially because this is like Hollow Knight and Sekiro, a game where my normal rule of not getting health upgrades doesn't really make any sense. Normally on my first playthrough of a game, I don't get health upgrades, uh, just as a matter of challenging myself. But these are ones where you simply find them in the world, and there's no re there's no opportunity cost. You, it's not like, well, I could level my health or level something else. You just you would have to go out of your way to not pick it up. Instead, we're just doing the half damage achievement on our first playthrough and hoping that it goes well. Also, I am trying to get over. You'll you'll hear some stuffiness. I'm trying to get over that. So apologies in advance. Medicine, yay. Well, berry flavored medicine, but to me it tastes like a like a blueberry herbal tea. And now we wait for it to kick in, however long that'll be. All right. Oh, you can barely even see them. Oh goodness. All right. I will say though, give me a second to grab the box of tissues. As you do. As you do. Alright. Well, here we are. 45.2%? <laughs> We're a little further than I thought we'd be, actually. Alright. So that answers the question. We're back at Castle Lockstone. <sighs> cool. Oh, so quickly. So I press right bumper for the normal attack, which we can chain up to three times. If I try to mash, that's it. That's all we get. Um, charge. There's your charge star too. Well, right bumper in this case. This is how we roll. Uh, this doesn't do anything. This doesn't do it. This is interact. And... Oh, that's right. When you don't have the... There you go. I forgot that the fireball doesn't actually have anything for it. Never mind. We're good. <sighs> Yeah, I can tell that I don't sound so great, so I'm sorry about that. Uh, actually, let's go here first. I might... No, I don't think that I've gone this way. Uh, here's how you introduce it. I see that now. Oh! That's not an actual door for you. Okay. These are ones, oh, you can hit them multiple times, okay, good, good, good. So I don't 
actually know if you can roll through that. I, I suspect my timing was just way off, but... What can you do? What can you do? Cannot roll through that. There we go. Okay. Never mind. Now we know. So it is like a Zelda game. Well, I think depending on the Zelda game, either the roll doesn't ever give you iframes or sometimes does. Oh. Depends on the game, though. I think. quick little, I hope, it's a quick little uh, answer to what people might be asking. I don't think that I have anything that starts with C and ends with O of it. As far as I'm aware, I do not. And I hope that stays that way. Alright. Oh dear goodness. However, it has been pretty cold in here, so I wonder if I just froze my toes off. It's all Hunting souls for breakfast, luncheon? No. Creature who knew ten thousand things. All eyes and tentacles and some things. Sometimes wings. Nah. Titans lurking in the dark and cold. The reaper strikes for glory, not... Mold? Old gold! Hmm. This is 
how sea shanties were made, I'm sure. There's totally nothing that rhymes with dinner, like winner. Oh, here we go. Okay. Sinner. Ooh. Oh, it it hones. Okay. Theodore. Theodore, the first successor in the lineage of lords. Their transition to power was smooth and their reign egalitarian. Remember for their fair nature, enforcing better working conditions for reapers. Hey, I'm okay with that.
again. Boxes, boxes, boxes. It's okay, we'll get them right back in just a moment. After all, we have box A.
see again. Okay. The one hit that I took was from the stairs, of all things. Oh, boy. Post in this fortress, I have learned a great deal about the old lords of doors. The old lords? Is that a Dark Souls reference? No. Still don't much care for them. first. I didn't realize we had so many. Jeez. Okay. Not only can we get an upgrade, we can get an achievement here for maxing out one of our stats. So next up is maxing out magic. Well, I might know the answer to the question. Oh! Oh, is this just all the junk we've been picking up? Just set it on somebody's desk. Rude. I always wanted a pet, but they don't let animals in there. Uh, that's right. Alright, achievement. Welcome to Soul Vault. Would you like to increase your combat abilities? This one in particular. Ready? Set. Achievement. Specialist. I'm hoping it shows up for everybody. Should have the steam overlay set up. Alright. Well, here we go. Hey, buddy. Going for scraps these days. Don't have assignments to go around. And only a handful of us Reapers left in service. I heard whispers. Maybe some crows living free outside the commission. Let's see. Oh. Oh, yeah, you can barely see it. I just saw it on my monitor. It's, uh, covered by my butt. There's an achievement for getting through this without triggering it. Apparently our umbrella is made out of metal. said, thanks, I hate it. We'll come back here when we have the hook shot. Now, where did the homeless guy run off to? I also didn't talk to the one that zoomed the camera in on us. That'll be okay. We'll be okay. Tiny castle. Alright. And then we get to watch the door shove us out of the way. Well, 
only a little bit that time. All right, <clears throat> here goes. A long time no see. Hey, I'll bet you we get the hook shot here. And I, I did see in the achievements it is called the well I said this last time, but it is called the hook shot. That's his actual name. Oh, stretching. Nom 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 nom. You died. Except nobody. Avarice. Those are fine. Those aren't the ones that just explode, period. not even sure that that was like the trimmer hitbox hitting me, it was just the very tip of the mace. Hey! Caw caw. A gift to a fellow crow to aid you on your quest. We get another crown? Is this a Dark Souls 2 reference? Shot spell acquired. Press down to switch to the hook shot spell. So now, for hopefully the last time, we will retread areas that we've already visited. <sighs> oh, uh. Oh, he doesn't use up any. Interesting, he doesn't use up any magic. Appears to be a Reaper's abandoned logbook. Legacy towards has seriously impeded my investigation into the disappearance of the Reapers in the redacted region. This whole process of transferring to a new system has been a nightmare. I found evidence that many workers were active in the region when the orders were given to cut them off. More worrying still is that the active reaping mission in the area was also purged from the system. Somewhere out there is a soul that has not been that has not been reaped on time. Cute looking gay, it really is, Danny. It really is. I like it. I like it. It's a recipe for disaster, that's for sure. We all know what happens to souls if they re remain alive past their death date. They get swole. That's, no, that's, that's what happens. They get swole. That's apparently why the Frog King and the, the Urn Witch are so massive. That's a technical term, by the way, massive. 
Yes. I like spoil mode, dear goodness. <laughs> Pop. 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 Ta da. I like that it doesn't. I know where I am. Click. Seems like the phone isn't connected to anything yet, I'm still. I had to check. Ah, not that one. I had to check. Oh, hey! That, that... I keep wanting to say Vega, but that's obviously not correct. That's the Street Fighter character. That Vaga reckons that something big's going to happen here soon. You know anything about that, buddy? You know, if we keep uncovering the truth... Yes. Maybe. Let's see. Take it off his clothes. Three to four years. Yeesh. Oh, hey, little guys. I don't know why anyone was complaining. These things are adorable. And I like the same TV shows as me. Ah. As I try to kill them. See, uh... Ball Plarth over here. He's very good at his job, clearly. Oh, here's the homeless guy. I'm just relaxing, feeding the birds. None of my friends want to eat off the floor. <laughs> let's see. Nothing there. Yeah, let's just do the, the same routine that we always do. Uh, how many? 325. Not enough for an upgrade. I'll try to upgrade dexterity after this, get it from 3, eventually to 5. Uh, so Lost Cemetery. Mm, I don't know that this is the way. I'm going to go out on a limb and say that there's nowhere that I can use a hookshot up here. And if I'm wrong, well, okay. Hmm. So what always happens, Janny, is when we get a new upgrade, I go through every area, except that one, eh, no, including that one, and make absolutely sure that there's nowhere that I can use the new upgrade first. Right, that's not an actual wall. Well, uh, screw them too, it works. Well, okay. <sighs> okay. Who's this way again? Oh, I know where this is. Oh, you can't drop off of ladders. See, this game isn't a Souls like. Not exactly. Don't you dare, Jay. Funnily enough, I think that they're only worth one soul each, but still, it adds up pretty quickly. Genuinely one of the more annoying enemies in the game, though. Ah, eh, why not?
no, 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 no. Okay. Uh, these cute little buddies. I don't think they can follow me through a transition. A door transition. Hey. That's a hitbox, all right. Oh, Jay, Jay, Jay. Ah, oh, Jay, you genius. Jay, you genius. Yeah, we, that was, we took two hits right at the start for absolutely no reason. Boxes, Jay. When you think you're safe, you're not safe. Because I didn't roll. 
you should always try to roll through those. Oh! Chunky cauldron ball. Yeah, this is not this is not as hard as I'm making it look. This is not absolutely not as hard as I'm making it look. Some of that is hitbox shenanigans, but not all of that. And by hitboxes, I mean they're bigger than they look. That's all. John Cena, are you sure about that? No, it's it's not it's not that hard. I'm just bad right now. See we can just do this, but we have an umbrella, so what damage?
know, the funny thing is, I'm not even sure that we're near the end. Because previously, we've had a boss that had three orbit around it. Which makes me think that this one will too. Yep, we're very, very dead. Are you sure? I promise, I promise. Okay. Given how long that took, I should have made that an actual attempt. But, <laughs> that ha happening that early? Eww. Oh, Alright. If you stay on his right side, as you can see, it has a bit of a hard time hitting you. go up a chimney wait what can go up a chimney down but can't go down a chimney what on earth am I hearing Okay, some of you um, that have been following me on Discord might have uh, noticed that I've been mentioning every now and then a kid that keeps coming over asking to play with Evangeline. Um, he's about her age. Uh, he and some of his friends just came into the house. Because since I'm in, I left it unlocked and they just, just waltzed in. Yeah, so that happened. They're kids... They're young. They can make mistakes. That's all right. But, you know, once once they heard the door, some of them went running. So that'll do it. Yeah, go figure. <laughs> I'm too popular for my own good. Oh, dear. Um, other, popular, other popular wrong answers are Father Christmas and your mom. 
go up a chimney down that can't go down a chimney up. Your mom. Let's do that. Jeez. See what I mean? This is this is how it's supposed to go. Well, more or less. Oh, Jay. Mine is the dying like a dull owl. up a chimney down, but can't go down a chimney up. It's an umbrella. That makes... Okay. I got you now. Successful attempt is not ideal. Silent servant has been vanquished and their soul power added to yours. Holding your arrow spell for longer will not charge your shot and cause more damage. This made me think of the disc throwing game in Tron. <laughs> Hawkeye! Hey! Achievement! Achievement get. Hopefully, slightly not covered by my butt. Hopefully. Hopefully. GG, I'll take it. Thank you, Danny. Oh. Get wrecked. Oh, we 
died, so those are all back. That's fine. In my defense, Umbrella, Ella, Ella, A, A, A. I was trying to think if there's anything else over here. used to actually be really challenging enemies. Pepperidge Farmer members. Hey, thank you, Bugsy. I appreciate that. stuff over here that uses the hook shot. That's right. Dark Souls boss, you just stay behind him. Just hug his butt the whole time. Nukes. Thick, yeah. He very dummy thick. Are you able to block or counter? No. Um you can there are some attacks that you can reflect, projectiles, but no, you aren't able to block or counter in this game. You can roll. It's like, well, I was about to say it's like Zelda, but a lot of the top-down Zeldas let you block as well, don't they? Ancient Shrine offers you a shard from a magic crystal. Two shards. Hey! We're 
going to find the last two magic before we find any of the health ones, right? That was worth it. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. I do have a... I don't know if either of you were here earlier. I have a... a bit of... just a bit of congestion. The kind that makes you want to drain all of the air out of here because it feels like there's a balloon inside of you pushing forward the whole yeah. It's not great. It's okay though. Uh where was I? Oh yep, yep, this way. I think? Maybe? No, it's all good. It's alright. I'll I have some medicine in me that'll hopefully help. Some uh oh, not acetaminophen, but something like that. It. Well, something. Something to help. And then right over here. Well, maybe it's on a different in a different room. Aha! Here we are. Anchors away. Also, you'll see me adjust the camera like this quite a bit. Hello. Wait a second. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Wait a minute. Oh, there it is. Hop. I knew there had to be something. Sinus, yeah. yeah. Unfortunately, sinus congestion. That's not great. I've also been sneezing a lot, too. So, hey! Well, okay. More boss fights. I guess... When in doubt, more boss fights. Okay, what on earth with the hookshot? Uh, well, you know how many times we've used hookshot in combat? I mean, we just got it, what, 20 minutes ago? that other fight should have gone. Oh, see? That's how that should have gone. <sighs> I don't know. Oh yeah, we have... Now we have the hookshot upgrade. We just got the hookshot, now we have a better hookshot. Sinus with a headache, take those meds sooner rather than... Yeah. Oh yeah, I... I took them not that long ago. They're already in. They're already, they just have to work their way through my system. Ay, silent Servant has been vanquished, and their soul power added to yours. Your hookshot spell now does a powerful slash if you use your sword while being pulled towards a target. Okay, we're playing Guilty Gear. Ever played Okami? Um, not enough to, mat not enough to count, no. <laughs> um, 
That's on that's on the list. When it comes on sale on Steam, it's usually about ten dollars. Um, oh, and there's there's the achievement again. Would that be a good game to play with Evangeline? I assume it wouldn't be any uh, it wouldn't be overly colorful. Oh no, colorful. That's a word. For, that's a euphemism for it. I assume it's the kind of thing that I could play around with an eight-year-old. Won't be too gratuitous or graphic or anything like that. Um, just from what little I've seen of it. We get the best music in the house. Oh! I was thinking of a comment when I asked about blocking. Oh, counterattacking. Okay. Fair enough. Oh, this poor drunk. I will never know love again. <sighs> there we go. That's as much as I care to dedicate it to that guy. Look at this perfectly normal human over here. I get some strange customers. You wouldn't believe it. One guy has a pot for a head. Have you ever seen something so unusual? You ask me if Okami is suitable? Yeah, if that's the kind of thing that I... It would not be... That was a good way of putting it. Um, I assume there's no blood in the game. I haven't played enough to know for sure. Um... I assume there's nothing terribly graphic in it, um, and I assume that it's it's not a horror game. I was trying to lose my fish head suit. I don't know. Part of the reason I'm playing this actually, when I am, is to see if this is if this would be okay for Evangeline. Um, and at first, I was going to say, you know, I didn't realize you could turn the blood off at first. Mostly yes, but the wolf you play can unlock the ability to pee and poop on enemies. Oh, she's a little kid. That would be. That would she would be giggling still. She's <laughs> we're still at that age, you know. Ah, uh, sure, we'll take a meal. It's the only thing a parent should be aware of. Okay, depending on how that's played, that that might be. <laughs> I don't know. It's very. She probably would. Yeah. And who needs chopsticks? Wait. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. Let me tell you a little something while you ingest nutrients. Heard there's a cracked wall deep in some dank dungeons. Dank. With a secret behind. Okay. Large force that wall might open a path. I'm assuming that's the dungeon before the flooded ruins. If you have a way to get across the water, there's more to explore along the docks nearby. Yep. Okay. Uh, heard some commotion in the west, though, so don't say I didn't warn you. Commotion in the West, that's the castle, I think. I heard there was a hollowed out wall in a key keyhole shaped alcove just north of here, inside Castle Lockstone. Hollowed out wall in a keyhole shaped alcove. It's an ex uh, it is an experience. It's like playing in a Japanese watercolor. Yeah, I, the aesthetic to it looks really cool. Sidekick character, a child might love. Oh, okay. Okay. That's all I have for you for now. Okay, and... Oh, this is totally normal. Totally normal. Just like my normal human friend, Octodad. Alright, we're gonna take on this area first. Just because it's right here. And by take on, I mean... There we are. Hop! Oh! I prefer this. Dark Souls. Welcome to the Asylum Demon. Ooh, go. Get away. Ah, emphasis on the <laughs> Asylum Demon. Emphasis on the... It's been on my wish list on Steam for a while, I just haven't picked it up yet. I'll get it eventually, there's just, you know, there's always other things as well. Ink-covered teddy bear. 
This would be very cute if it weren't so disgusting. Aww. Poor thing. Poor Teddy. Oh dear goodness. If you're playing Guilty Gear Strive though, that Teddy gives you a command grab. Trust me. Source, trust me. Bridges moves as they like third of the screen hop into a command grab. It's it's a thing. Uh, if you catch them just mindlessly blocking. Oh, excuse me. Hop. One of the tricks to an isometric game is that if you're playing a, con a controller without notches, sometimes the diagonals can be a bit hard to hit. There are weaknesses in the walls that the eye can't see. Beneath a wooden walkway, a secret waits for thee. Wooden walkway, a secret waits for thee. Beneath a wooden walkway. Okay. Notch controller. In other words, game controller, best controller. Sauce, hi, <laughs> Heinz ketchup. Beneath a Cut it up. Cut everything up. Uh. Hey! Neat. Weakness in the walls that the eyes can't see. Behind twin columns, a secret waits for thee. Behind twin columns. Twin columns. Star Trek? <laughs> no, I don't think we have actually. I'm not against that. I'm not as. I'm not very. I'm not adept enough to talk too much about it, but I wouldn't be against that. Columns. Super Mario Sunshine. Columns. Behind twin columns. Alright, here it goes. So earlier at the in the last stream, I said I know that this place has to be for something. There has to be something here. There are weaknesses in the walls that the eyes can't see. Beneath a gargoyle, a secret waits for thee. Still probably have to find the column one, right? Columns. Beneath a gargoyle. Um Specifically, Picard... Okay, just a sec. This is just the way up to the castle. Uh, season 1 was a travesty, especially... Uh, episode 1 of the Season 2 had promised. Reviews of the Season were poor. Didn't watch Season 2. Unprepared for how good Season 3 is. Modern Star Trek... Oh, okay. So I don't... I, point of reference here. I don't have any streaming services. So... If it's something that's on now, I wouldn't... I wouldn't be able to comment on it, unfortunately. Um, I basically my my TV is YouTube, and then the occasional wherever I can find an anime to watch, wherever that may be. Twin columns. Thank you. 
Amazon Prime, okay. Let's see. Yeah, I don't have Prime either. I'm one of those I'm one of those folks. I don't tend to spend too terribly much. Hmm. Well I guess I can just start chucking bombs everywhere. And if I'm wrong, well, we have these little crystals to give us more anyway. It totally deserved it. It knows what it did. Oh, check this little detail out. This way to the mountaintops via Castle Lockstone. This way to Just a cute little detail. Is there some way to get over there? Oh, we can reach that far. I oh, fine. Uh, I can aim. quickly. Always offered a free trial of Amazon Prime when you buy something, just cancel it straight away and get it free. Oh, okay. I forgot that I can actually still use my hookshot even when I don't have ammunition. That shouldn't be anywhere near as hard as it just was, though. Guess what, buddy? Ooh, okay, that's a hitbox. Only thing you need to know, just skipping to season three is a uh, spoiler for season one. Okay. shard from a vitality crystal. Hey, HP. Woo! As 
me after we kill the plague doctor. Doctor, give me the news. Thanks for sticking around, Buxy, for a bit. I appreciate it. You the man. You know that? You the man. <laughs> We're not quite to enough for a dexterity upgrade, so I'll actually stick around for a bit here. Twin columns. You know, if I didn't know any better... I suspect we probably would, my friend. I suspect so. I hope so. I did something amazing and once in a lifetime thing with my carefree place to. Oh, what'd you do? <laughs> I pot flick souls bar grab. Wait, his, uh. The the the, ultra, the super that he does, where he like this camera zooms in on him as he turns into a dragon, and then he just rushes across the screen to grab you. You can pot flick that. Nope, not there. Twin columns. If we're thinking about the same thing, that is seven levels of bad A. Okay, maybe. Exists to serve those who oppose the Lord of Doors. Uh... Oh, this was the gargoyle. Okay. Gargoyle. Dragon install grab is flickable? Okay. Dang. I did not know that. You taught me something new. Yeah, taught me something new. I already went here. All right, I wanted to see if something would happen anyway. And it looks like the answer is nine. Oh, oh! Here we are. Columns. Weaknesses in the walls the eyes can't see where a giant face stares secret ways for That's that that was it. So we did them a little bit out of order. Goodness. Goodness. Alright, so that should do it. Switch back to our handy dandy hook shot. Take a quick little break here in just a moment. Hey! Ta da! We did it! If that's what I think it is. Achievement! Weapon Master, you found a great sword. This was clearly wielded by a very imposing figure once upon a time. You can equip it from the weapons menu. No, we can't. No, we cannot. This is an umbrella run. Oh boy. Umbrella, Ella, Ella. A, A, A. Uh, actually, before we go there. Dungeon time. Oh, okay, that was funny. <laughs> Little ex exactly the bomb landed, the screen was black and white. Oh. <laughs> What's this again? Lockstone. Oh, we have more to explore in Lockstone. Uh, let's just do that first. Alvaro. Okay, but hey, 
Just a quick second. I will be right back, folks. You know the drill. Give me just a minute. So one of the kids that waltzed on in earlier <laughs> left one of his Crocs. Uh, a Croc is a type of shoe, and it has holes in it that you can use for, among other things perhaps, uh, to put little badges, little charms, whatever you want them to be. Uh, this kid had his name on it, so I even, <laughs> I even know who it was that got in. And at some point he's going to have to come back for it. I have a sneaking suspicion uh, Mama's not going to appreciate the kid coming back with only one shoe and not having a good explanation for it. Well, right. What say you now? Hey now, that shiny new hookshot thing of yours looks pretty neat. Hookshot viewers, do you think it could help you cross that gap up there? Maybe. Cinderella moment, yep. Yeah, got a Cinderella moment, but with like a nine-year-old. Don't mind, I'll leave the adventure to you, but don't worry, I'm documenting everything. You should have enough material for a whole saga after this. You better, because there's an achievement tied to that. Oh, excuse me. Uh, not that way. Uh, which way do we go? Which way do we go? This way? Nope. Maybe? No, probably not. It's not. Oh, but we can do something about it.
I like how you don't have to be quite precise, just as long as you're close enough. Make sure I didn't miss anything down here first. I did not. Thankfully, that one is an actual wall. Oh, I thought that was a keyhole earlier, not just part of the wall. The wall. The wall. Here lies Lord Opengate, the third in the lineage of lords. Their rule was steady and without a hindrance. A ruler skilled at delegation has spent many of their years expanding their knowledge while traveling the vastness of space. Eventually, cars stopped thinking. Mr. Hologram. Greetings, young Reaper. Your presence here is quite a conundrum. It would indicate that the course of events which started with the formations of Death's Door has led to the universe, uh, led the universe to the brink of great peril. However, it also it is also indicative of those actions correcting themselves. Life is merely the universe experiencing itself. Yes. And, as the universe seeks balance in all things, we, as parts of it, are all acting to maintain that balance. Stay true to your path, young Reaper. I can sense victory in your future. I hope so. I certainly hope so. Oh, thank you. Appreciate that phone. Definitely something over here. Aha! Oh, did it just say none again? Fantastic. Yep. Alright, well, this has happened before, don't worry. Just a quick moment. Yeah, I, I see what's happening. Alright, sorry, this is where we cut the game off and then back on again. And hopefully, we're all good. Hopefully. Maybe. Okay. Just a moment. That does mean we have to go back through here. There we go. Ta da! Alright, our controls are fixed. They're not janked up again. Technical term, janked up. how we were supposed to reach it, but we can. Nope, it looks like we were supposed to do it that way. Who needs rules? Apparently. Apparently. Hmm. I don't remember 
to there being anything special in this room for okay. Nope, we've already opened this one. Lord Lockstone was the first, yep. The only one that's not particularly punny. There wasn't anything else in here. making sure that couldn't be a grapple point. <coughs> and low, it cannot. Neat. Oh yeah. There's that one. There's the one back in the throne room. Or, it's not throne room, that's what we call it, yeah. Oh, that's 
right. It yeets me. Looks like I might have to use Researching how to flick it since then, turns out everything was a lie. Did the internet did the internet tell lies? Uh-oh. from it, it was visible for like one or two frames. Wait, you, Roman cancelled out of the super? Why? of life extension. And almost there. Hey, buddy, guess what? The Roman cancel was only visible for one to three frames. Pretty much almost invincible. Almost invisible if you don't... Yeah, fair enough. Oh, dear. Life is not easy. The balance of the universe was my duty and mine alone. Lord who created me had grand delusions about fate and purpose. Lord who created me. But fate did not bind me to death's door. Duty did. No other could take the task of controlling life and death, so I bore the burden. Bore the burden. I bore it for as long as I could, even extending my life beyond the bounds set by the pitiful anachronism that is death. Anachronism. When my time finally drew to a close, my successor paid no heed to my teachings. I fear the rain may have destroyed the balance I tried so hard to maintain. What a bitter disappointment they have been. Greatness is seldom free, Crow. True greatness may even cost you your own soul. Your soul. So I'm super. His goals were beyond human numbers. Yeah, uh, that, that's that was what I was thinking. Hold on. You can change. Okay, you can change.
quite what I meant to do. Hit the wrong one there, Jay. Unlike the other one, this doesn't seem to be speeding up. creates the next in succession before their death and teaches them the Lord's path. Funny thing is, Roman Cancel's startup is around 5 to 6 frames. If you get hit before it finishes, it doesn't consume bar to trick you into it. Ooh. Did a holy amount of research on Oh, wow. <laughs> you could almost create your own universe out of that. My creator, the Lord before me, bound me to their system. All I could do is try and balance the world as fairly as I could. I tried my best to do right by the living, especially the crows recruited into something they had no business in. If opportunity presents itself, child, ending this cycle would be what is right for the universe. It is Dark Souls. We have a choice to extend it or decide to knock it out, hopefully, maybe, totally. My lifetime is too short to come to that ultimate conclusion, but I remain hopeful that others will reach it on their own. Firstly, before I forget, we are looking for a place, a keyhole-shaped door, I believe he said, where you can get another shrine, I think. Oh, wait. I see a big keyhole-shaped door on the top left.
back and... Well, I could go back and see the hint. Or maybe it's another door, but... That seems like it'd be the one. But... It wouldn't be that simple. very perfectly normal regular human folk okay let's see crack wall we haven't gone there yet hollowed out wall in a keyhole shaped alcove keyhole shaped alcove just north of here inside castle lockstone fight back. Rare though that is. I, I do like it. Forgot to say something important. Oh, what's that? No fight? Okay. It's a map. No, not a map. You found some kind of signed contract. How exciting. When you think of exciting, you think contracts. Also known as being a contract lawyer.
Maybe that has to do with the area up here. Maybe, probably not. Oh, like this again. Hmm. Jefferson? that to open anyway. Regardless. Keyhole shaped alcove. Ah! Sorry about that. 
I see that door up there. So still might not have the right place. Hollowed out wall. Even kind of knowing what I'm supposed to look for. side, perhaps. Which I think means going through here. I think. down here, right? Because this one who would be where the fight would be. The ladder shows up after you succeed, though. Hmm. Unless it's on that side. Which would be exactly my luck, wouldn't it? This is that keyhole-shaped alcove, right? What if you finish the game earlier than expected? Uh, at this rate, we're having a bit of a hard time being a completionist over here. Keyhole-shaped alcove. Mm -hmm. uh, agony. But that would be nice. If I do, I wouldn't say no to it. Certainly. Certainly.
keel-shaped alcove. have required us doing uh, bombing hidden walls. Uh, that said, there are... Oh, uh, well, the crystals could be up there for the fire. That makes sense. I'm over here trying to figure out where this one dang secret is. your question that you DM me? Kingdom's Edge? Okay. Cool. I like that. I like that answer. For me, maybe White Palace? Uh, well, you sealed vessel movement too, but that's not a, that's a boss fight. It's part of a boss fight. So that doesn't really count. Although it's also the music in Path of Pain, so... Halfway counts. Just partially. Yep, I am the person that will drop down just to check underneath there, just to make absolutely sure. We'll be back into uh, we'll be back into Castle Lockstone though. If we don't find a way in again from here, we'll need to figure figure out how somehow. Nailed it. Nailed it. That's what I was trying to do. Right. That was terrible. Wait, hold on. Hold on. Neat. Another seat. So yeah, I got gaslighted for one day. This made read entire paragraphs of game mechanics. <laughs> How'd you take it? Uh, just a little congested. Hey, at least you're all the smarter for it now. At least you're all the smarter for it. Maybe more broken, but smarter. Now you know. And knowing is half the battle. Why you like this game in the description is a lie, and I know it. Only reason is because it's a Dark Souls dodge roll. It's all unique, Camp of the Free Crows. 
I don't know. So, I typically have am not a huge fan of the Zelda formula, but that's usually when it applies to bosses. Zelda formula for exploration, I think, is pretty good. Personally. Poisonly. Now that I have you, I want to try something else. Oh, no, they can. They're just done. Uh, this way, I think. Ready to head over to the mall cop? Hey, we get an achievement! <laughs> mall Plarth... Plart Hall Cop. There we go. He said Breath of the Wild. By the way, New Zelda comes on the 12th. Ah, uh, expect Breath of the Wild. Okay. Ah, uh, I will not be... Uh, not, not Breath of the Wild for me. Welcome to the camp of the Free Crows, old friend. We knew you'd make it here eventually. Even if you needed a bit of guidance along the way. <laughs> we are a group of free-thinking individuals who reject the ideas of the Lord of Doors. Oh, CJ, by the way, fun, fun fact, uh, the weapon that we're playing now, playing with, we're playing with the broken straight sword, basically. Or imagine, I guess a better comparison, uh, would be, imagine if you're playing Hollow Knight and you can't upgrade your nail. Or, imagine if you're playing Hollow Knight and your first nail, the nail you start out with, is half the strength. That's what we're playing with right now. I can't make it where I don't gain H, or where I, uh, I, I can't do the no HP rule in this game, so instead, anyway, only to hop it in for a sec, gotta go now. Hey, see ya, CJ. See ya. do my best. I'll try to have fun. We do not want unnatural immortality, even if it must come at the cost of our lives. What's the point of living forever if it's to be as a slave? You steal crow's souls and make them your slaves. No, we choose to live free and die free. So go, climb ever higher. Defeat the beast at the top of the mountain and claim its soul. Oh, but make sure you're well prepared before you head onwards. Remember, you're welcome here anytime you like. That's an easy key. Make sure you're well prepared before you head onwards. Foretold Crow, it is an honor to meet you. Oh, Raven, did you find any of our shrines on your journey? Seems there are still five shrines you've yet to find. I'm sure they'll help you on your journey and, and in the fight against the beast atop the mountain. Well, we're, we're working on it. Not yet, but we're, we're trying. Rook. <laughs> Welcome, foretold crow. We live a simple life here, foraging and living off the land. We even use fur shed by the beast atop the mountain as bedding. Fur shed by the beast atop the mountain. Yeah, yeah. uh, I can't talk the ones way up there. Same dialogue? Yeah, yeah. Greetings, foretold crow. This is the gate of knowledge. Its eyes see all things. Its heart knows all things. And its soul exists in all things. It whispers to us when we need guidance. It foretold your arrival and your destiny. This? I mean, I'll take it, but we're not going there yet. I'm gonna run by the restroom before too long. We all abandoned our assignments, which means our life now ticks away. However, we are happier for it. This is the way it should be. Without death, new life cannot grow. Technically, that's not how that works, but okay. Please, please, something. Aww. Something hidden, would you kindly? This 
way to the frozen canyon. Exercise caution. Um, actually, I guess we'll start along this way first. Firstly. Ooh, I can see why. Exercise caution. I can see why. Oh, timer. Just in time, too. Uh, wait a second. Hold on now. Uh oh. I wonder how long that one will last. Ooh, we did it. Just a race. Uh. Ooh. I didn't know that, that could happen. Another shrine. Almost there. Almost there. See, it's not even a whole area, it's just this. So called free thinkers when the fire alarm goes off. <laughs> oh no. I think that that counts as a decent enough reason to, uh,. Maybe think with the others. Group think. Maybe. A little bit. Slice. Don't go all the way up, Jay. Don't go all the way up. Whew. It's, uh, it's quite a steep climb getting up here. My pipes are still wheezing. You must be pleased as punch, though, huh? I mean, a secret crow society up here in the mountains? Who knew? They have so many great stories about their lives up here, especially about the beast atop the mountain. Yeah, I'm getting so much inspiration on our adventure. I think my next song might be the greatest I've ever written, and I've written more than five. Hey, quite a bit. Should we head down the mountain? So we can, well, a safe distance. Aww. 
He's there. We have old watchtowers. Okay. Nope. 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 Alright, so we have only four more to go. Um. I guess I could go by the others first. That stranded sailor. Let's see if I can figure those out. There's another one in here? Oh wait, yes, of course there is. I know that we haven't gone all the way through it. I think about it. Because we haven't been back here since we got the hookshot. Yay, damage. You are strong, like mother. Hey, I like to think so. Alright, so there's that. Uh, the hookshot up there. this enough. Raw. Pop. Gotcha. Got him. What an agent. Okay. Well, what's done is done. We'll just have to walk our way back around.
Oh no, you don't. But, you know, we've already done things out of order. Might as well just keep doing it. Keep at it. Hey, what we pick up? It's a day drawer. It's a malformed seed. Doesn't look like a normal seed. It appears quite rotten. Uh oh. We already got it. Out, but it can't take it. Oh, there's even more. Okay. Don't mind if I do.
Maybe there had been some in there that we already picked up. I don't remember having done so, but maybe. This, there's this one. Um, buddy. How do we get there again? So it is in here somewhere. So we can figure out how. It's going to take me not that way. we can get back from here.
Is the stairs? is pretty good, to be honest. Oh, uh, was I walking backwards? I guess I was. Wait, hold on. Okay, I don't know. Hmm. Oh, yeah, sometimes you just don't make it. Tell me, uh oh, oh, kilobits per second, not 25k. Uh, okay, okay, that was a thing. On my dashboard, it said no data, and then I look at OBS and it's giving like three times the limit I had told it to. So I have no idea. Shrine offers you a shard for 25k what? Yeah, yep. Yep. 
So, in other words, it was trying to send 25 megabytes a second, which is uh, slightly more than I need. Or megabits, rather. Slightly more than I need. Goodness grief. Right. So we're... that's... that's one of them. Ta-da! Quite a lot of V bucks. Oh dear. Uh, v bucks is. Oh. Ah, uh, I, I see that. I want to think victory bucks, but I'm sure it's like a video game currency or something. Something. Hello, Mr. Shork. Mr. Shork. Dash dance. Woot. Woot. Alright, and we're out. We're free! Our souls are free! through here because we know that we need to pick up the uh, shrine, not the shrine, the hookshot areas at some point. Although I probably should, uh, we'll find a flower, it'll be okay. Probably should heal, but we'll find a flower eventually. Maybe, hopefully, totally. Geronimo? used to be actual hard enemies. Pepperidge Farmer. Oh, okay, hold on. Ah, uh, I shouldn't have committed heat. That's okay, we'll find a way down. Right here. See, this is one of the hookshot areas. right back but yeah we, we, we need to take need to take a break here give me just a moment you know the drill
so apologies for that taking as long as it did. I went and got some more, something nice and warm to drink. Although, didn't, hmm, hmm, didn't last for very long. There's also some water starting up to uh, make some tea, some nice hot tea. Where are we again? Oh yeah, um, is there anywhere I can use the hook shot around here? And I think that the answer is no. Oh, that's a, that's a strike, all right. Okay. Okay. I know that there are in the estate. I know that there are some hookshot locations in the actual estate itself. Oh, and yeah, for V-Bucks that you mentioned, Janny, that, I, that is Fortnite. For some reason, I had an inkling that that might have been it, but I doubted myself. There's nothing down there. Oh dear goodness. Oh dear. Where are they? Let's see. We're somewhere up in the top right, if I remember correctly. He says as he goes in the opposite direction. Okay. Yeah, that's that. Okay. We're not in the top. Top left needs the we've already visited. Itchy nose is itchy. Been down there. You know what? Better safe than sorry. I don't think that there's anything here, though. This music, that part right there, gives it something of a sinister tone to contrast with everything else in the music, in the song. Oh yes, there's one over here. That's right. Pop. Easy peasy. Just some, just some pickups there. Alright. Let me go the way that I'm pretty sure I remember that was jumping. Okay, bye. The Mario movie is coming out tomorrow. Might be. Oh, okay. I did not know that. Uh, 
if I do end up watching it, it'll probably just be with Evangeline. I don't think that she would have any problem with that whatsoever. I think that's more than safe to say. Ah, okay. Ooh, you actually get two, at least two, for doing a charge shot there. Uh, charges, that is to say. three hours ago and got stopped on my way home by police. Picking something up on the side of the road is illegal. And wearing gloves and... Wait, what? Is that for real? That's... That sucks. I would not have guessed that. Oop. Yeah, I did not have enough time to get there. Face covering and a long coat is <laughs> uh, gloves, a hood, a face covering, and a long coat. Now that one I can kind of understand though. I don't like it, but I can at least understand that. As opposed to picking something up. That's just weird. I actually thought I could hit it from out of range. Actually, I was pretty sure that we had done that earlier. We have a one strength upgrade, which improves our range ever so slightly. It hasn't really helped us out much. Well, I say that. Yeah, I guess it has. It's sped up a fight or two. I guess. Really cold outside. Now that's... Yeah, that, that sucks. I'm not saying it's right. Bruh. Bruh. Yes. And rip. Oh, by the way, we have fully upgraded fire. We are hopefully in pretty good shape here. Got him. Got him. Oh, hey, Janny. VR chat. What is... So, does VR chat... Do they still not have mods allowed, or... Did they walk that back? Please tell me they did. Wait, did I not light all these already? I was pretty sure that I had. Once we actually start leveling haste, I'm going to have a dodge roll and not know what to do with myself. Like an actual dodge roll. Then I'll be unstoppable. That's how that works. Uh, mods for the game itself, I don't know. Maybe mods for avatars and more. Okay. I remember for some time they, uh... You know, 
they, they had made it where you, they implemented easy anti-cheat so that mods couldn't go onto it. Which, great job, great job. This piece of municipal property used to be attached to the bridge going over the train tracks, but it fell off. Oh, oh, okay. See, when you said that earlier, I thought there was some weird law in South Africa where you could, or at least in your part, where you couldn't pick things up off the ground or something weird like that. We have this, there's a city not far from me that has a weird law about it's technically illegal to eat fried chicken with a fork. Yes, I'm serious. Which, you know, clearly the greatest of all crimes. Eating fried chicken with a fork. Worthy of death. As we all know. Well, drink water with a with a scoop. Oh no! We killed them again. You killed Kenny. All right. I don't remember anywhere that requires a hook shot, but just to be on the safe side, I'm gonna go and explore a bit. Explore. Oh, hold on. Who is this thing? I missed that. Symmetric platforming. Hey! You found an old photograph. What a lovely couple. I wonder if they lived happily ever after. Oh no, you don't. Oh no, you don't. found the picture but no sign of them, I would say no. Well, one of them might be the witch, and then the other one, yeah, probably not. We're looking for places to hook shot, or apparently to burn, maybe burn, Disco Inferno. Kill them again! He went glister off without context. Kill them again! Why 
might bother doing that. Did they break it? Well, not... I mean, I didn't have the... I was inside, so I didn't have the door locked. They just walked in. I don't know if that counts as breaking in, but... You know, they just... Like, they missed the car out in the... Never mind. So, I mean, I, I guess... not the end of the world. If anything, if nothing else, I guess it makes for a story. Oh, we've been here, that's right. Do we go in this way? Kill them again. Oh, you can even hear the unlocking sound. Unless I have to do something with the chandelier. about the police again. Oh, yeah. I gotcha. <sighs> I am still sorry you went through that, though. That's no fun. That's no fun. That's no fun. That's no fun. Makes for, it does make for a good story. Use the hook shot or the fire. 
fire, for the PK fire, for that matter. PK fire. Remind me in a second to check out what, um, sh what collectibles or shinies we have. I think the achievements page calls them shinies. Actually enough that we could buy not one but two haste upgrades here. Really quickly. But uh, I'm going back to our handy dandy friend, that one castle. You know the one. Where was that? Castle Lockstone. I think that's over this way. We'll save up for the dexterity upgrade. Since Team and Glistro was the first one I told, Chuck the Lemons app. Does that make them my best? Aw, oh, that's true, Senator Johnson. When life gives you lemons, go down the Cave Johnson route. Get your engineers to design combustible lemons. Oh dear. Demand to see life's manager. How does he say that? I'm gonna blow your house up with the lemons. Something like that. Ended. T1 Glister Elf is my best friend now. High five says, Oh, jeez. Don't get burnt, don't get cooked. He says, as he's about to get cooked. Oh, oh. Laser cooked. Oh, dear goodness. Oh, goodness. It's just reminded of a, a video that's, uh, I am bound to get somebody mad today. It's just bound to happen. Um, so there's this, uh, I'll, I'll give a little bit of context, so I saw a video that popped up on Le YouTube of a, some years ago, I think it said seven years ago, a KFC in South Africa where they were, em the employees were outside washing chicken that looked to be inside of a, like a tub or something like that. Um, now, Apparently, that was chicken that wasn't meant to be sold, which is good, because you are very much not supposed to wash chicken. That's, that's, that's a cardinal rule of cooking. Thou shalt not wash chicken. Um, so the, the idea is basically that you're, you cook the chicken in order to kill the salmonella and whatnot inside of it, if they were E. coli or whatever the case is. You cook and if you get it to a high enough temperature, that'll be sufficient to kill the germs. However, if you wash it before that point, you're able to spread those germs around your sink. And that is, technically speaking, no bueno. Uh, why am I just breaking these? Uh, so you can spread the salmonella. Like, let's say that your chicken does have salmonella. Oh, well, here's the room I'm supposed to be in. You can spread it into your sink, your countertop, your utensils, all of that jazz. And if you're thinking, well, this is a really obvious... Well, I can understand someone who doesn't know any better. It seems like cleaning it would make it uh, have fewer germs without... You know, and then you realize you could just cook it and that would kill the germs. Uh, but there are some people... I later discovered going down an absolutely insane rabbit hole in the U.S. that have the, almost the exact opposite mentality, that they think that you have to cook it, or else
else it's not edible. Hold on. Hey! Keyhole shaped alcove, it said. Ta da! There we go. But for. Uh, in the US, it tends to be uh, African American folks. So, black folks that tend to be more likely to do that. Why? The only reason I've heard is that it might have something to do with being slaves at one point and having... not exactly having access to the freshest food, so you clean it first to make sure. But that doesn't apply nowadays. <laughs> nowadays we can process our food, but maybe it just keeps going on through tradition. Ancient Shrine offers you a shard from a magic crystal. Fills your soul with power, raising your magic. Oh yeah, yep. So indeed, we got our magic first before we got cooked crow. Doesn't sound all that. No, no. Well, you know, I say that I don't eat meat. I imagine that crow would be something. Crow would be to chicken what venison, like deer, deer venison specifically, is to beef, which is where it would just taste more tangy, not tangy, gamey. There was also this one story about a fried rat at a KFC- Oh, Oh, dear. <laughs> KFC. No, 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 no. Oh, dear. <sighs> Let's not say we didn't. Kentucky felines called to deal with the rat problem. So where else are we supposed to go? Um, there was one in Mushroom Dungeon? Fried rat story later turned out to be a- okay, good. I'm glad that's not true. <laughs> there, there's a famous video in the US of a rat carrying a slice of pizza down, uh, uh, down a, a flight of steps at the subway. Just, you know. New York City is the- it, wait, I think it's New York City is the one that has its own strain of mosquitoes. Effectively a different subspecies of mosquitoes that exist only there. I may- it may be a different subway though, but there's- there's one of those, which is kind of obnoxious. Uh, later turn- okay. Pot, pot, pot. What about pot, pot? Oh, pothead in this game? Oh, are we trying to get the stream to mind? I mean, uh... Oh! Oh yeah, there's clearly some more I need to get to. Alright, you fools. Riggity wrecked. Or something. Uh... There's nothing this way, is there? Just, just the door. Just the door. Uh, probably this way, actually. Heaven's a door. He says, hoping that he's right. Oh, okay. Oh, nice. Hey! I, uh... Wrecked. Was that a League or Dota where the guy... He said three words in response to something having happened in the game, and one of them, the last one was wrecked. Laughs in malaria. Oh dear goodness. Yeah, it may very well be. Malaria may very well be the biggest killer of humans in history. More people having died to malaria than anything else. Uh, 
proper order. Alright. And then there should be one more. Um. Cool! Oh, Ancient Shrine offers you a shard from a vitality crystal. You have now you have, you now have three shards. One more will raise your vitality. you wonder why they made such a big deal of COVID and barely do anything to help people who've been dying but um that's a good question so the malaria one is because here in the US while we do have very isolated instances of malaria it doesn't usually affect us and unfortunately Americans are not typically well known for caring about problems that don't directly affect them at least not on a political level you know in politics at least not so out cheese individual Americans, that can be a different story, but, uh, it, it's difficult to get politicians in the U.S. to even agree that foreign aid is a good thing, that you, you should, you know, just, uh, foreign aid as a concept that you should look into. Uh, and then we leave, and then we get this guy, he knows what he did. Dave knows what he did. And there they go. Also, I love how it hit itself in the process. Flower hit itself in confusion. Just a little conga line of death. Conga line of death. The new romantic comedy starring... Uh... Pennywise? Now, there are, I know that there is some U.S. aid specifically for a malaria vaccine that's already been invented that is something like 30% effective, but that's a relatively recent thing that we've started doing. I'll just save up for the last dexterity upgrade. It decreases the amount of time I have to charge my magic attacks, so, and it also means I can swing more quickly, which means I can get my, I'm gonna call it soul. Oh, uh, Stranded Sand. We'll go talk to our good friend Jefferson. The totally normal human. Perfectly normal biped, right? I don't know any mammals quite like this guy. I, no, no, never mind. He's a perfectly normal mammal. Greetings, fellow biped. My name is Jefferson, a humble bartender and seafood enthusiast. At your service. By the way, probably no voices today, just because I don't feel all that well. Staring, staring Pennywise, and worst of all, Adam Sandler. <laughs> right. Great. One delicious meal coming right up. I sure do love preparing food with my multi-digited mammal hands. something while we ingest nutrients. Very place you entered these forgotten lands. Oh my goodness. Alright, well actually that's fine. That works. The very key to this forgotten land. Oh, oh, I'm supposed to check on my shinies. What a nice and convincing mammal. <laughs> You never would know otherwise, would you? A ring? Oh, we can inspect. Uh, we can't turn them like in Skyrim. Old compass. Incense. Oh, but wait a minute, this is Dark Souls. See, there's a uh, description by each of them. This ring belonged to the Urn Witch, a gift from her late husband. It dates from a time long before you were even an egg. Egg. It seems uh, she may have had to remove it because of her constantly swelling body. Ugh. Such are the risk of living beyond your years. The compass occasionally twitches and turns by some strange whim. It mainly appears to be drawn to death's door rather than pointing north. It must belong to an explorer who is searching for the legendary door. There's nothing otherwise to know after... Oh, no, nah. 
one thing I, I wish that Skyrim had is a description for the items, but can you um, imagine how many there would be? Incense used in ancient rituals to aid the death of the dead in their passage to the next life and to mask the stench of corpses in the embalming process. The label on the side reads, Incense of Atonement, perfect for masking that rotting corpse smell. Undying Blossom, it's the white flower from Sekiro. I mean, Elden Ring, true, to be fair, Elden Ring did it. You're not wrong. This flower's petals are soft and delicate. Yet its appearance is what- To be fair, Elden Ring didn't have spoons and forks that you could pick up and cast iron pots and <laughs> wooden plates and wooden bowls and- or bowls at least. And bowls, because those are two separate things, and also bowls, because I think there are more, and Dwemer- yeah, you get the idea. The forces that resonate through this place seem to allow life to continue, even beyond its natural point of conclusion. Let's see. Old photograph. An old sun-damaged photo of a couple at their wedding. A treasured memory of better times. It looks like someone might have, uh, have used it to draw on. Uh, then again, comparing Skyrim to Elden Ring is like comparing <laughs> Bethesda from software. Uh, you're very much not wrong. I do, I can see some of the uh, inspiration that Elden Ring drew from Skyrim, because it, it drew it from lots of places. Yay. All right. Oh. Oh. I didn't even mean to do that. Oh. Uh, okay. Well, I know what that means. Also, Skyrim is like 11 plus here. True. True. It's, it's as old as, uh, well, I say as old. It came out in the same year as Dark Souls. Which is, uh, fun to realize. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Do, 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 do. Okay, cool. I am going to forget that, so, sorry, we're coming back. So, I was wrong. Turns out, you can turn them. I was trying to do it with the D-pad earlier. Wait, wait, wrong section. Is it? Yeah, just the wrong section. You can turn it with the stick, not the D-pad. The stick. Dark Souls did it <laughs> too, so like, because Skyrim just had, what, an order of magnitude more things, I guess. I, I think that's the actual reason, it just had a lot more things. dexterity upgrade, put points into haste so that we can move more quickly. Just explore the world, world a bit more quickly. That is right, okay. What was number one? I think it's one, two. Oh crap, that's not what I meant to do. Oh, neat, one, two, three, four, five. Uh, to be fair, I might have noticed it even if I didn't do that, just by hovering over it like that. Because now that, yeah, yeah there we go. There we go. One, two, okay, so we got the wrong starting one. One, two, three, four, five. Neat. 
Plot head. There it is. You found a rusty garden trowel. That looks quite fancy. It must belong to someone who loved taking care of plants and flowers. Congratulations, you are a gardener. Wait. That's a... Uh, two planters right next to each other with no enemies. Uh... Yep. Hmm. Okay, then. Time to plant. Yeah. Wait, wait, what was the uh, achievement for that one again? Pothead is Access Pothead's Secret Garden. Pot Hunter. There we go. His secret garden. Sadly, or Perhaps for me, it's a good thing. That is not an emulated thing. And stay dead. Oh, that means we killed them. Uh, rip, I guess. Well, that's not even worth any. see that. Ah, okay. And... You found a makeshift soul key. I wonder who made this. Wait, is that it? Crow souls, I suppose so. The legend of Pothead. Ah, oh, there we are. I mean, this is what I was meaning to do earlier. For no reason, just because we can. To assert dominance. gets bright. Bangs, yeah. Oh, my favorite too. As you can see. to Jefferson Davis Beauregard. Beauregard Davis. That's who that is, totally. Alright. Elden Ring has plenty of those for what I, yeah. Oh, the... Uh, I like the flashbang right before the final boss. 
That's my favorite. That's my favorite. It's my favorite. Humble bar da ba da ba da. Yes. Great. One delicious meal coming right up. Cool. Good. 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 All right. So you ah, very place you enter these forgotten lands. Yep. Never mind. Uh. Okay. So. I am blind. Apparently. Apparently. As you were. It's a Grove of the Spirits, part 76. Spirits, grow with the sprites, spigots, sprints. Whale. Ah, like that. Why you gotta be so bright? Okay. Maybe. Maybe there's a bombable surface? Maybe it's further. Maybe I did miss something else over there. See anything that I can bomb? See, this wall is lower. And that makes me think that there's something there. Place where you entered these forbidden lands. Ah! Uh... I know where we are. And there we go. There's another achievement. Achieving all. Zen! Oh goodness. Stretch. And also get low so that make people can see the steam overlay. An ancient shrine offers you a shard from a vitality crystal. Hey, fills your soul with vigor. Raising your vitality and giving you the health back? Yep. Cool. Good, 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 good. Can I commit E? No, I cannot. Alright, well, we have maximum HP now. Does not open from this side. Thank you, Dark Souls. Bye, little one. Uh, you know what? We haven't collected... <laughs> we've collected everything except for those giant souls, right? 
Yeah, not a single giant. Alright. Um, well, we can fix that. Let's see. I guess we could go after the beastie first. Beastie boys. I swear, I feel great. Um, hmm. Oh boy. Let's see. Oh, uh, yeah, that's right. That's what I was going to do. Check on. Now, there are certain achievements that are tied to how you do the boss fight. So let me make sure I don't utterly mess this one up. Because I know me. I don't know if you know, but I know me. I'd like to think I do anyway. Alright, so, Death's Door. Mm-hmm. And then... It, Steam is being weird. When I click on the achievements on there, it sends me to the to my profile, which is not exactly what I was meaning. Let's see. Is 12 upgrades? Nope. Upgrade it. Nope. 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 Right, 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 right. We've gotten Weapon Master, gotten all of the upgrade related ones for the uh, spells, tools, whatnot. Uh, let's see. Zen, we just got that. Hot Pot. Okay, here we go. Set Grandma's Pot on Fire. Let's see. Where's the. Make the Frog. Feed the Frog King an explosive treat. I don't see anything here about a mountain beast. Alright, I'm going to... Let me, let me go, let me be a genius and go for what appears to be the hardest one first. That's the smart thing to do. Absolute giga brain, right? That's how this works. Okay. And by what appears to be the hardest, I mean, I'm assuming you're probably not supposed to do this one. First. It's right at the tail end of the game, right? You have to get further along for this. Mountain Beast, that's it. Oh boy! I'm going to need some coffee before I get started trying to kill this thing. And sleep. Well, here goes nothing. The old watchtowers. Borders of the Forbidden Region. Oh. Okay. Uh, cool. Never mind. No fight yet. Yet. Never mind, we just have a normal ish area. Oh! <laughs> Lined up all three. I can't help myself. Oh, there you go. I think that I'll walk off the edge though. It's a little tipped fate there. Hold on. Yes, please. Probably 
shouldn't use it yet, but uh, well. it's done, it's done. That's right, you can't roll through them! shoot you. Weather sure is rough up here. The wind's just howling through my pipes. Still, a bit of bad weather has never deterred me before, especially with the beast so close now. I wonder what it looks like. Based on what the crow said, it sounds like a proper monster. All hairy and wild. I can't wait to see you fight it. Man, I feel that. It's down this way first.
don't see anything on which to grab. Not yet.
answer here one more time. So we're trying to figure out how to get that life seed in there. 1,371. At this rate, we might actually end up getting a getting the final dexterity upgrade before we do the fight. Definitely getting that upgrade first. See, I have my moments of not being awful in this game. I just figured it out. We have to respawn the enemies first. I guess the upside is that we get our health and flowers back, so that's not nothing.
So on this way. game actually had a pickup animation for that, I can imagine that you would keep sliding even through it. Alright, here it goes. That's why this is here. I'm glad that I didn't use it up. Alright, just a second.
Sorry. Still muted from when I used the tissue. You didn't miss much. You missed me getting onto myself for getting hit at all, and then being like, oh, we should have gotten it hitless. There. There, I summarized it for you. Also, I guess you missed my reaction to her name being Betty. Steadhome the Gravedigger. We gather here today to mourn the passing of Betty. To some, she was revered as a god. To others, a Pokemon ripoff. I swear, I can't remember its name, but it's the giant one that sits like this and only takes every other turn. To others, feared as a wild, untamable a tameable beast, untamable, untamable, and to a small few, loved as a radiant beauty. After many lifetimes lived atop the mountain, supplying locals with fur and untimely deaths, she can now rest. Bow your head in remembrance. Ten out of ten summary. We'll listen again. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Well, and I guess on the upside, that means you got to actually hear the boss music, and hear the sound effects, and hear the everything except me. That's pretty neat, right? Maybe. I don't know. Her, press F to pay respects. Her time in this world is over. You know what? I'm going to pay. I'm going to pay my respects. F's in the chat. Hey, you. Give me my achievement. What an incredible adventure this has been, full of twists and turns. So Betty and the Beast were one and the same. Amazing! I prefer JSMR over K <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> Thank you, I'll take that. This means the drunken guy at the Stranded Sailor. Was he in love with the Beast? Oh! Whoa. I feel kind of bad for them both now. Dead or heartbroken, which do you think is worse? Both kind of tragic. Still, it's great material for a so song, huh? <laughs> I'm going to start writing straight away. Once it's ready, come by the Stranded Sailor sometime and I'll play it for you. Will do. New masterpiece. In fact, let's go there now. as we're getting to me singing to and it's gone oh no this is different seeking a reward? Have some chicken noodle soup without the chicken and without the broth which is made with chicken. S soup. Hey, have some ramen. Very good job, little one. Look at that. Bravo. Now, be a good little bird and turn them into your vault. There's no need to bring souls directly to me. I have more important matters to attend to. Ciao. Coffee. Wait, you have a giant soul. It's the wrong one. I can't process that. How'd you manage that? Never mind. Get back out there and find your assigned soul. 
829. We got 700 souls for that? Oh, dang. Uh... Fast drive. Yeah, sure. Let's go for it. Hey, big spender achievement. That means we got 12 levels. Neat. Neat! That's right. It's neat! This way. Alright. Next. Let's go up against Froggy. Froggy. Where are you, Froggy? Where did he go? Mad Stolas vibes in this guy. Oh, we don't get our... Uh... We, no, we don't get our soul back for that. Or magic back. <sighs> Alright, you. Um, okay, you're, you're not bothering me, I'm not bothering you. Oh wait, hold on now. Wrecked. Never mind, I am bothering you. Should be this way. Pop! Playing Mario Tennis. Sure, why not? Alright. If there is a speed increase, to be honest, I'm not noticing it. I guess we didn't get all the way through, did we? Oh! Oh, crud! Oh, that's... This is from Hell of a Boss, by the way. Super gay and all of it. Hell of a Boss. I know I've seen that before. Haste. <laughs> the most cursed way of spelling that. Haste. By the way, I'm disappointed in you. I made a... I said, thrust me. And you didn't make a reference automatically. And then you ended. Nah, I'm just kidding. You're good. I'm just messing with you. Jay, it's 428, forgive me, I'm sorry. No, you're good, you're good. I know, you're joking, you're joking. 
We're both joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. I think this might have been the way. No, this this is the way. This is the way. If you need to sleep, by the way, sis, go for it. Joking or choking? What am I? Ah, uh -huh. uh, oh, 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 I see what we're supposed to do. Oh, there we go. I see what we're supposed to do. We have a maid who comes in every week. Oh, okay. See, it works out. I didn't, didn't pick it up. I guess. Works out. Uh oh. Dodge! Oh! Someone is after me. Oh, 
Oh, hello. You think you're all that. Oh. Uh, okay. Looks like that was the only teleporting mage. What other mages are there? That? Also, we're at 596 already. Who is that? Ah, there you go. I know who that is. Oops. Actually, no, we're fine. We'll, we'll take it. We'll take it. Uh, poor flower. Poor flowey. Alright. Oop. I. Okay. Yeah, it turns out if you mash roll without holding a direction. You go down right. Did not know that. Alright, how much are we at? 650. That's an upgrade. That's an upgrade. Sorry. Throne of the Frog King. Froggy. Okay, we'll stop. Stop with that, Jay. Stop, stop, stop it. Stop. Increase your combat abilities. More haste. magic card. Mm-hmm. Yep. Are you feeling it, Mr. Krabs? Let's see. Crooked Crow! Clearly my grunts have failed to teach you a lesson, so I'll have to do it myself. Yes, this is the voice we gave him because the first word he said was oi. After I'm done with you, I'll use your feathers to buff my armor, make it all shiny. I'll be the most handsome creature under the shadow of the door. Alright. Squishy time! King of the Swamp. It's a 
Yu-Gi-Oh! Got Guardian of the Flooded Fortress. Lord of his domain, ruler of all his space, champion of the people, keeper of the five of his first of the name, second of his other day, he's without no initial mercy, destroyer of the- Oh my god, we have Zot here! What are you going to take, my dude? Uh-oh. Yeah, there's not exactly a lot of room left. What if Ripper Roo were awful? We are about to be left with just the edge. Yep, and lo and behold, that's what we have. Oh, wow. Okay, and it looks like if you run out of tiles, you don't respawn on the edge there. You just die. Oh, hello, Jay. So, I'm not sure that life is really the concern here. That's gonna be tr uh, tricky. No. Yeah. All right. Here we go. Don't miss. Whatever you do, Jay. Don't miss. Hit his little uh, staff there, I think. How? That's how? Okay, here. Ooh, get out! Oops. Oh. Hurry, hurry! Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Must be some way to hit the mace on his back to respawn all the panels. Either that, or we just have to just focus him down. Just hit him really hard, really quickly.
Okay. If there was some secret to getting him to respawn the panels, I have no idea what it is. It does make me think that that fight's supposed to be something of a DPS check, though. If, if you can't get him to hit his mace. If you can't. We gather here today to mourn the passing of the Frog King. A bold and fearless leader, he was persecuted for his simple desire to place all in the forest under his rule. Simple desire. And, occasionally, his bottom. His reign is ended, and his absence will be felt across the swamp. Bow your head in remembrance. Pay your last respects. His time in this world. F for Frog King Zote. You found a giant arrowhead. Wanna be on <laughs> wouldn't want to be on the receiving end of one of those. No? No, I don't blame you. Someone will be pleased the king is dead. But a life is a life. indicator over him. And then of course you can't do it. And here we go again. Yep. Nope. Huh. Huh. We didn't get another cutscene to go talk to the Lord of Doors. Really. Also, 550? That's it? Time to go take down the witch. The wicked witch. Alright. Whale then. Uh, that would be up this way. In the basement with Pothead. go this way? There we go.
we don't have a C, do we? It's okay. We'll, we'll come back for it later.
I didn't think I made it in time. I remember you from seven hours ago. That's how you're supposed to do it. I 
Sasuke. Grandma, free my friend Pothead. Yeah. Alright, this is one of the few exceptions I'm going to make, Evelyn, for the... Oh, hello. I'm not going to say that, though, for the voice. Crows never do what they're told. Mm -hmm. I am trying to save lives here. Don't you understand? Death cannot see those who mask their life force within an urn. I can fool the Grim Reaper himself. Hmm. You and I have something in common, little crow. The same employer. Yeah, I can figure that from last stream. But goodness, we can't have them finding out about everything you've seen. Hmm. Don't worry, I'll put your ashes in a lovely urn. Grandma. Witch of Urns, Grim. Oh, I... This shouldn't 
be that hard. This is with maximum dexterity, and we're still having this issue. Oh no! I didn't get an achievement! I'm an Egypt. I forgot to do the bomb on the Frog King. this we can do a very quick playthrough just speeding our way to the frog king just for that one achievement hopefully maybe goodness I forgot about that well okay then oops we gather here today to rule the passing of a woman known by many names the witch of Irons ceramic sorceress, earthenware enchantress, crockery crone, and, of course, Grandma. Driven by her maternal instincts and consumed by her endeavors to unwit death, she filled her life with a passion for magic, reanimation, potions, and pots. Her journey is concluded, and now she is at peace. Big F's in chat. Still, I hope she finds peace beyond life. She can finally be re reunited with Grandpa. Uh, Grandpa. Slip of the tongue. I quite literally have pots on the brain. Seriously, though. R.I.P. Gran. Or Gran. She died as she lived. With a pot on her head. Well, yeah. As you do, I guess. It's lit, hey. <laughs> All right, whale. How many do we get? Enough. Welcome to the Soul Vault. Would you like to increase your combat abilities? Uh, sure. We do. Yeah, just the one. All right. So now we have all of the souls. Now where do we run off to? Oh, oh, I know where we go. Well, I don't know how to get there, but I know where we go. Where's the fastest way? Uh, probably Lost Cemetery. Work our way up that way. Uh, 
up, I said. There we go. So that we don't accidentally unequip it. Yep, again, we are hopefully near the end of the game. Well, I say that. I don't have all of the achievements. I don't have that many of the achievements at all. I thought he was sliding on the ground. This is it. This is the place beyond where no life is to be seen. Uh, hello? Oh! I think I've seen you in a trailer, maybe? Death. Hi, Death. create portals, doors, to any place or world. They offer to outsource the collection of souls to an automated system using one of their doors. While it was open, it would draw in the souls of the dead. A lighthouse on the shores of the Aether, if you will. In return for this, they asked for their lives to be extended. Well, Actually, they asked for immortality, but that's impossible. Uh, if souls stick around for too long past their expiry date, then with nothing left to tie them to mortality, they decay into demonic forms. All life must end. Well, eventually. So while I kicked back, several generations of these self-proclaimed lords of doors came and went enjoying their unnaturally long lives, each one agreeing, in the end, to submit the, to the limitations of life and go willingly into the ether. Until the last one. Until one didn't. Which brings us to your current Lord of Doors, 
Towards the end of what should have been their lifespan, your lore betrayed our long-standing agreement. They said there had to be some kind of incident, that the door malfunctioned and needed to be remade anew. For the door to be reconstructed, it would require the touch of death to link the door to the ether. I know what happened. You got shoved on in. But after this new door was created and opened, the Lord kicked me inside and sealed it shut. No way for me to escape. No way for stray souls to pass onto the ether. No death among the living. I've been here alone ever since. But my assigned soul, it must be here. It has to be here. I tracked it to this door. It must have entered somehow. Are you, are you sure you haven't seen it? Sorry, guy. If a soul comes in here without a body, it disappears into the ether. Sooner or later, everything that begins has to end. Uh, that means that Grey Crow ended up dooming us. still be here somewhere. No, 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 no. I wasted so many years searching for that soul. Decades, centuries. I refuse to die. Uh-oh. I sense you're a little bit past your best before date. Uh-oh. The Grey Crow. Oh, that still hit me. First try. <sighs> I can't tell you how long it's been since I've felt a fresh breeze on my face or saw, well, anything. <laughs> Magpie for dinner, yeah, pretty much, Danny. You never appreciate something until it's gone, do you? I saw a lot of that in my job. But until your Lord of Doors locked me up, 
I never thought it'd apply to me. I'm sorry about your big feathered friend back there. It's always hard for the living to let go of the dead. Even more of a rough one, having to reap him yourself. I can sort of understand that feeling. Uh, even if it wasn't your intention, uh, you've done me a huge favor here, Crow. But this isn't over quite yet. Because while the door has been destroyed, my power is unfortunately still trapped in its remains. Forging the door required a piece of my own soul, and I need it back before I can do my job again. Forging the door required a piece of my soul. Okay. That means if we want to end this cycle, someone else has to take down the Lord of so Doors. Have you guessed who yet? That'd be me. I won't be making any more deals again, that's for sure. Head back to your office and reap your boss's soul, Crow. And remember, death is on your side. Okay, well, we're almost there. Looks like it. Giants, giants, giants. Everything will come out of the Oh, there is a way down here. I don't know that this is faster, but maybe. It does get us to Lost Cemetery. So yeah, magic. Play play a magic build. Uh, I'm not getting a good voice. My fellow crows, we have arrived at a moment foretold long ago. Today, death's door has been opened, and death themselves has been freed once more in the world. Fear not, for this is not the end of days, but the beginning of a bright new future. The forces of life and death have been unnaturally thrown into chaos for a thousand years. Crows have played a hand in that. We must right our wrongs. We must accept our fates. We must reject those who lead us into a future with no hope. It is time for the Lord of Doors' reign to end, and for us to return to a natural life cycle. Even as our world teeters on the edge of oblivion, souls like these four spirits still manage to emerge through the cracks. Soon, a new age will begin, and the world will teem with new life. For that to happen, the final hours of this foretold day must play out as ordained. The crow that freed death will have to end the Lord of Doors' reign. That'd be me. Hello. Alright. I like that. Well, so... Uh, yes. Well, the only one that we can do. Take the strength upgrade. It's not much, but this is our final build. Two strength, five dexterity, three haste, five magic. I'd like to think that we're doing okay. And we've only been using the freaking umbrella. Unfortunately, the strength upgrade doesn't do us a lot of good when you're, you know, dealing half damage, but eh, it's something. And I guess our reach gets improved a bit as well. All right. So once again, give me just a moment, I will be right back.
I need it. Tea's on the way. Actually waited too long to go and get some more, so I needed to reheat it, unfortunately. Okay, well, here we go. <clears throat> we're as ready as we're going to be, I guess. I know this place. I've been watching you, the young crow. I never really thought it would come to this, yet here we are. Each of my kind are created by the Lord preceding them, and trained to take over their duties before they pass on. On the day we are created, we are told the day on which we will die. My predecessor, my creator, was a cold-hearted tyrant. Is this game just about people who didn't want to be dead when it was there? Pretty much. Yep, pretty much. Um, Grey Crow didn't want to die. This guy didn't want to die. All of the giant souls, except maybe Betty, but yeah, no, even Betty, didn't want to die. No. And that, that's basically it. Obsessed with rules, and I guess technically that applies to us too, because the whole reason we went on that quest is because we wanted to not die, ideally. We wanted to get our soul back that we were assigned. Obsessed with rules and order, how things had to be. The old fool never even gave me a name. Can you believe that? Uh, I'll give, give you a name. Uh, let's see. Theodore is taken. Deadbolt, I think, is taken. Uh, how about... Knobhead. There we go. Ha 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 ha. How would your life play out if you knew the exact day you were going to die? If every moment of your existence revolved, around, existence revolved around its ending, I had to do everything in my power to save myself. I know my actions are not entirely moral, perhaps not even justifiable. But I cannot- whoa. <laughs> Left bumper and right trigger can be used to advance the dialogue. But I cannot just let myself die, I refuse to go without a fight. So, young crow, are you ready to fight for your life? As I am for mine. I hope so. Oh yeah, he doesn't have a name! Oh, oh, too slow.
getting a little bit careless here. Full health. That one scraped you pretty much. Pretty much. Uh. Gee, I wonder which way the game wants me to go. Steps of the Lords before me? To repeat the same things over and over? And to what end? What is the point? If 
we all have to die eventually. I suppose... I will never know. Because I will never die. Don't tell me I have to start back in phase one. <sighs> oh, okay, good. Good, 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 good. I will never die. Well, uh, got bad news for you, buddy. Neither will we.
Well, we did it. We did a thing. Beat the game. Stay at home the Gravedigger. And I know we beat the game because we got the uh, Academy of Umbrellas achievement. Which you get for beating it with only the Umbrella as your melee weapon. The pursuits may have been unwise, but the will to live is deeply ingrained. What is to say what any of us would have done, given the same choices as this lord? Bow your head in remembrance. Pay your last respects. The time in this world is over. Hey! Wink. Jeez.
22nd Century Toys, Lion Bridge. Sorry, we're gonna skip Zigvert here. Zigvert, Zigmar of Katarina. That's as good as you're going to get from me right now, unfortunately. Oh dear. It's alright. Yep. Good old Zigmar. <laughs> Epilogue. I see that thing on the ground. I see that thing. Nope, we're not done. Crow Gamer. Ah, uh, nope, nope, nope. I saw that. I saw that. You're not fooling anyone there. Pick up. You found a rusty bell tower key. Hey, the lower doors must have dropped it. <sighs> well? Okay then. Uh, hey, strength upgrade. Three hits. Oh, wait a minute, we're not tied to this umbrella anymore, are we? Nope, now we can do other stuff. Thunderhammer. Rogue daggers. Twice as much, this deals more damage at the expense of agility. Oh my. dexterity on these little suckers. Well, you know what I say that. Oh, you only get two? Eh, I think that we want to play with the rogue daggers. It's still going to be more damage than we had been getting, but also a lot faster. Point eight versus point five. If we could beat the game with an umbrella. Alright. Ring a ding! Ring a ding! Ding. It's Dark Souls, you ring a bell. Oh. Oh, that's neat. Uh. Oh, hi! Hello! Game's not over, it seems. Oh, neat. We have to carry them over to... Okay. Well? Hey, buddy. Care to follow me? Right here, dude. Boop. Well, never mind. It looks like we still have more to do. Disturbing. But it works. 
well, uh, hmm. Oh, hey, buddy, there you are. one over here. There you are. Come on. Come on down. back to the start. that I remember. I thought that I remembered seeing one over here somewhere. So here's another one. Well, one of you goes here, right? And then the other one goes here. What if the Spelunky ghosts were actually friendly? for just one of them? Okay. I mean, I'm okay with that. No, seriously, where does this thing go? Here, before I run around Kingdom Come with it, let me actually find the guy. Find where he went off to. So it doesn't look like it's here. It's not here.
found my buddy. I'm just taking a nap. somewhere, right? Near you? Surely. No. I would think it'd be around here somewhere. ahead a bit. I think we've already explored this side. Unless there happens to be one even further this way that I didn't remember. Which is possible. Over near the start, perhaps? so, since it goes through a transition, but just making sure. Yes. So, we did go through this side already. Maybe there's something up here? Maybe? I'm gonna go through all of this for nothing. It's not going to be here. There's a different one that was up here, wasn't there? That one is already lit. Well, at least it's an area I haven't explored in a while, so... Maybe we'll find something a little bit new-ish. There's one over here somewhere? Up and up and up and up. Alright, come on. This can't be right. This is a different, yeah. Evening, Reaper. I don't really sleep anymore. I lie here each night, wondering how it would feel to no longer be living. If we were dead, would we even know?
feel so congested right now. Oh well. Wait. Were we just here a bit ago? Yep, we just we were. I wonder if there's a statue over there, but no. Maybe there's one over this way. This is just the other side of the same coin. Oh, uh, yeah, I saw it disappear. God. Where am I supposed to go? Uh, you have my permission to yell at me when you see it. That's where the shrine is. That's where I need to be. There it is. There we are. Are you... Wait, what? Oh, okay, so there's seven actually. having a hard time 
getting to getting to it ah, is different than the one that I just found. This again, this silliness again. Get out of here. Started the area? Maybe. Maybe. Yeah, this might count as a distinct area. Sure, you can follow me around. I mean, I'm not doing much of anything, but sure, go for it. I like it how it makes it make uh, our character looks like they're a little bit, just a little bit bioluminescent. Try going through. Well, we've been just about every way, haven't we? See, there you are. Um. Where's this window? There it is. It's so dark I couldn't see it. I passed by that twice. go. Well, um, you know how if you play Super Mario Odyssey, you beat Bowser, and then the game really starts, where you can start collecting all the rest of them? Yeah, that's what this bit feels like. Or at least that's what it reminds me of. in this case it's not collecting the same thing over and 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 over again. Moons. Uh oh, what's this? You have acquired an ancient tablet of knowledge. You feel its eye gazing into your soul. Okay. Um cool. in the know. Wait, hold on. No, this is the wrong way, isn't it? No, no, this is fine. It's not what I was meaning to do, but we'll make it work. Strong arms, itty bitty legs. Ooh, there's an owl. Oh, hello. Oh boy. Are you feeling it? Are you ready? Fight time!
Oh, hello, J, 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 J. the damage came from the bugs. Alright, what do we get this time? Oh. I, I, I. Oh, another ancient tablet. Okay, cool. I'm seeing a theme here. same thing 45 times. should be. No, nope, no portal. Right? It was over here, I think. I may be mistaken, but I think that that's right. damage again. Okay, so we don't get portals anymore.
Isn't there something over this way? Just this place, I think. I'm going with it doesn't make any difference. <laughs> Maybe I'm not even supposed to be here. Oh, it's nice having damage. That's really nice. Uh, Frog King's domain. like we have any ability to teleport around. Um, so I don't want to quit out, because I might lose some progress. Hey, we have music again! What do you know?
anything moon related? Ah, here we are. Well, then, no, I don't know where I am. No, no I do. Okay, we're back in the normal area. Oh, I feel so congested. Kinda hate everything. Oh, we have a door again. Just said enter. Oh, well, let's go. Flooded fortress. Okay. What the heck? Um, I guess we don't get any more upgrades. I do kind of want to go all the way around it to see what I can find, but god, that might take a while. What are you even supposed to be looking for here? Now let's go down here. You'd think for a reason. I think that's how that tends to work. Six. Got it, got it, got it. I wonder if this is some sort of DLC that was added. Clicked on your stream after watching a video of you talking about Claw and Melee. Do you still play? Uh, <laughs> I do still play with Claw. I don't play Melee as much these days. Um, I, but, yeah, if you <laughs> if you ever want to jam a game, I can get it uh, booted up on... Oh, join the Discord server? And I can get it booted up on uh, Slippy. That'd be kind of neat. That would... I would not be against that. But definitely not as much as I used to. For sure. I hear that. I hear something anyway. What is that? Aha! Hey, bud. Oh, excuse me. There we go. Line him up. Fine. Yeah, I played with Clockwork and basically out everything these days. Pretty much. I hope you're having a good day, by the way. That's really cool. I play Claw and everything except, me except Melee. So I'm trying to make... Go for it. Who do you play, if you don't mind my asking? I... So the first character that I tried playing uh, competitively was Luigi. And I used it just to... Just to, you know, jump a little bit more quickly. Um, not having to transition my thumb from jump to C-stick or whatnot. But... It also, it's really good for Peach. What is this? Okay. I think I know what that is. Okay. thought it was a seed counter, and it might be. Hey, buddy! Big face! I certainly wasn't expecting to see you here, especially at this hour. This is my secret garden. I come here sometimes to tend to my flowers and relax. 
Play Fox and Mario. Oh, okay. That's an that's an interesting combination, Fox and Mario. Have you managed to grow any more seeds in the pots I left around? By my reckoning, there are still two pots left with nothing growing in them. Try looking in Grandma's basement. For the seeds or for the pots? Because I know that we have two pots down in the basement. I don't know where the seeds are. I mean, it might be the same answer. Maybe. Okay. Also, I'm a bit congested, so apologies if I if I sound kind of. Ah, uh, it's a technical term. Ah, uh, that's why. Stuffed up. Get up. Oh, you can't get over there. That's right. Now we've already been through this, but. Maybe I missed something? Oh, I already got that. What's the... Is the Mario just for fun? Or... I mean, I, I know you said you play competitively. And I know Mario can do some stuff. Stuff, is it? Also a technical term. Um... And I'm, I'm not very familiar with Mario as a, as a character, unfortunately what he does really well. Um, hmm. Oh, Dr. Mario! Okay, now there we go. Uh, Doc's down throw. Just, I love it. Just on its own. That's all you need. All you need. But yeah, that, that I can see. There's a di side of me that definitely wants to say that Dr. Mario's Probably an underdeveloped character. Yeah, Luigi's gotten all the love because he's Captain Slip and Slide. It has some really cool movement to him. Oh, hi, buddy. Don't stay lit. We got a whole Discord for Doc. I, I believe you. I believe you, my friend. I don't mean you're underdeveloping. Underdeveloping. I just mean like people in general. I don't think pay enough respect to the doctor. Ah, uh, whale, whale. Hmm. We did. Yeah, we did go that way already. We did go this way, but. Checking to make sure. So the world can change a little bit now at night. I'm trying to find out what changes, if any, were made to this area. What changes, if any? So far, the answer is some new enemies, but that's about it. Oh, maybe this part's different. I've already been here. Ah, uh, no. But I, I play uh, Puff and Peach. I used to play Fox, but I don't know. For some reason, I just I found I wasn't having as much fun playing the character, and it just I don't know. I, I, I even now I don't think I can explain it to you, but I think Peach ended up scratching an itch a little bit more than Fox did. That technical character itch where. You know, you've got the simple character and the technical character, and I think I just found more fun playing Peach. I get to play a stance character in Melee. At least that's how I like to think of it. A stance character. Hey, buddy. Rip. Ripperino. Uh, sure, why not? There's probably an answer to why not, but well, it's all right. Peach is very yes, yes. I like to think of any time she floats, that's her stance. Oh dear. Um. Well, I 
think we, well, maybe towards the front. Maybe there's something in the front. But I think there, huh. Isn't anything new here? Let's see, we've been up here already. This way again? Nothing new. God, I feel so freaking congested. Uh. Oh, you check the Discord. What's your favorite Soulsborne? Oh, my favorite Souls. Ooh, Elden Ring. Elden Ring. Uh, it's Elden Ring, Dark Souls 1, Dark Souls 2, Dark Souls 3. Uh, I'm not sure where I place Bloodborne, actually. Mm, I guess it's sort of a mood thing. Around Dark Souls 2, somewhere around there. I think, depending on the day. I think I'd usually put Bloodborne over too, though. I think. Do you have a favorite? Is it? It's 12.36. Okay. Gonna speed through this really quickly. And in just a moment, I'm probably going to end up taking a just a quick little restroom break, and then... Oh, Se yeah, Sekiro, I don't count as a Soulsborne game, even though it's definitely a From Software game. It just feels different enough. But if we had to throw Sekiro in there... Um... I mean, I, there's not a game that they make that I don't like. I like all of them. Um, I think Sekiro is probably right behind Bloodborne, but those are those feel very different. Uh, one was a long, uh, long time favorite for me before that. Fair enough. Yeah, uh, Sekiro. Yeah, but Sekiro's a rhythm game, but I mean that in a good way. Everybody's favorite rhythm game. I tried selling a friend who is big into Osu. Yay, Sekiro gang! Big into Osu about uh, Sekiro. She's really big into like Japanese culture and likes playing Osu. So, hey, it's a rhythm game set in feudal Japan. <laughs> which is which is true, I suppose. So, I could keep trying to explore around here and figure out what on earth is going on, or, or, for right now, save. We're not, we're not done with the stream yet. We're not done with the stream. And there are monks with homing missiles. Wait a minute. <laughs> I thought that was a Toho thing. Monks with homing missiles. Yeah. Alright. Hey. So give me just a second, I'm going to run by the restroom, and then we're going to take on a quick little speed run, kind of, to Frog King, whatever his name is, for an achievement tied to him. But we're not going to be using the umbrella, we're going to be using a real weapon, so hopefully it won't take too terribly long. Alright, give me just a second, eeny meeny miny, CJ is here, so...
says. I, I know why it said Animal Crossing. It's not supposed to say Animal Crossing, naturally. Oh, that's that's an OBS thing. I'll I'll fix it after. Rainy day goes hard. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> no kidding. There is actual Animal Crossing music in there. Uh, just just not not that one. Not exactly. Oh goodness grief. Goodness. <laughs> All right, Adrian. So what we're going to do? We've started a file, and I stopped this one and went on to the other to do the umbrella. Uh, quest, Umbrella Achievement. Well, turns out, here we go, turns out, now that we've done that, we don't need to go through it again. So, let's see, where am I going this time? I think we go this way. So we will be doing twice the damage with this character as we did with the last one. Thank goodness, oh, hold on, never mind, we haven't done the fight yet. Oh boy, <laughs> we're not even taking this character all that far, just far enough to get to the Frog King. So CJ, in Hollow Knight, you have to do three hits to get one spell twice. Well, in this game, not so much. Charm combinations that could lower that one hit per spell. I know Spell Twister exists, but hold on. And yes, the music is very nice. True. True. We're also not going to go for all of the uh, extra little, uh, you know, the, the charms and whatnot. Because all we have to do is just kill the Frog King with a bomb in phase two. That's it. We actually... So, in two fights in this game, you have achievements, public achievements, that kind of give you a hint as to how you're supposed to do them. I don't know why I bothered putting it there, but okay. And one of them is uh, that you're supposed to use a bomb on the Frog King. Otherwise, the second phase is really stupid, because... He's like Ripperoo, except he never gives you your tiles back. If you if you know who Ripperoo is, you're great. I mean, also, uh, how are your joints doing? Soul Eater. Oh, Soul Eater, Soul Catcher, Spell Twister. Okay, I had forgotten Soul Eater was even a thing, but yes, you're right. Hey, title card. So we should just speed through the game quite a bit more. So that means, CJ and Janny, that our broken straight sword run is over. Now we get to use actual weapons. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. So I had this thing going for a little while on the channel where I had someone pick a Pokemon. Any Pokemon. It didn't matter which one. And I would have to do a Dark Souls 1, 2, or 3 run based on what Pokemon they picked, 
because the types of the Pokemon determined what I was allowed to use, and I could only use whatever was given there. So someone said, uh, oh, what's it, Gallade, I think is its name, which is a fighting uh, fairy type, which meant that I could only use Fist and Magic, and what I did is I played Dark Souls 1 and used the Kaistus and just kept enchanting it, and that's it. That was the f <laughs> that was the fist and ma uh, yeah, 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 yeah. fist and magic grind to earn to earn. All right. Uh, if you ever play Dead Cells, achievement for beating the game with a starting weapon, another one for beating the game with a sword that makes everything one hit. You. Oh boy, I don't think I have Dead Cells right now. Well, you know, I might. I have so many games, I might. It may have come in a bundle that I picked up at some point. That's possible. Alright, two shot, two shot. God, I hate these things. Yay, two shots. It is nice doing actual damage. Trust me. It is wonderful. Wunderbar. Oh, an umbrella is a weapon. It fights off rain. <laughs> True. Can't argue with that, Janny. Can't argue with that. Beating the game with a sword. Uh, sword. Oh, okay. Making sure I was caught up on chat. <sighs> if I go for a while without reading a message, without reading the messages, I might miss it. So, I'll I'll try for that not to happen. No promises, but I'll I'll try. I see you down there. I see you. Else is a roguelike Metroid. Oh, okay. Okay. That sounds pretty good. I do like these Metroid babies. <laughs> also, I have to map everything to Dark Souls. No, in Dark Souls, it's R1 is your hit the stuff really hard. The spam move. R2 is the hit the stuff really hard. Well, in this game, it's I guess it's more like Hollow Knight, where it's R1 is my attack. At least the way that I play. Alright, activate. Save the seed. Try to remember which way I have to go. Hey, Pothead! I enjoy it. My favorite weapon is the explosive crossbow, and yes, it's because you can whack things with said crossbow. Do they explode? <laughs> There we go. Oh! For, I'm thinking dead space. I might have dead cells then. I might. Solar her? Is that you? <laughs> I wish. Yeah, Kevin's amazing. Oh, yeah, that's his name. Kevin. Kevin. He's cool. In case being let me solo her wasn't cool enough, weren't obvious enough that he's cool. So usually, those enemies aren't much of an issue, but I, the hit that I took earlier is because I didn't see what the enemy was. Holy heck, three hits? I don't know what to do with myself now. Oh, hey. I don't know if we got a cutscene cancel or what, but I'll take it. Eh, skip it. Save it. Oh, 
I'm not even sure if cutscene cancels are a thing in this game. Hey. Come on, there we go. In other words, that one might not have locked us into place anyway. Nope, doesn't look like it. Aha! Hey, more seats. His name is Pothead. Pot. I might actually put some points into strength for this character. Who knows? Fiery! Hey! Good job. Yep. Who needs health? Health is overrated. Um, crud. Okay. So, I have no idea. Wait. Yeah, this is not right. All right, we're fine. We'll worry about it later. 
we don't, I think there's maybe a seed on the other side, which we don't need. Need the <laughs> need for sp seed. That sounds... Uh, need for seed. There's a, there's a euphemism. I said we weren't going to go for these, but this is not that far off the beaten path. I figure we might as well. And it saves us from having to do it later. Okay. Oh no, T1 broke his promise. Oh no. Oh no. Hey, you would make a good statue, my friend. Elden Ring has broken me. I read that as TOGETHER! <coughs> Sorry. Yeah, if you're quick enough, you can get those three in first. Excuse me. Duck, dodge, dip, dive, and... Dodge. What are you doing here? Okay. I forgot that uh, small smo happened to be around here. I know, I know. Uh, whenever you feel like it, bud. Right. It's a Dark Souls boss, the ass silent thing. so much better. You know how it works, one of those games where you're so, so much better the second time around. Yeah. I don't recognize myself. Yeah, that gave us quite a bit of trouble the first time. Well, we didn't die to it, but we, you know, we took damage. That counts. That counts as trouble. Let's go with... yeah, why not? I bet there 
is something around here from the pit, maybe. No? Okay. Cool. Aha! Teaches you how to do it. Zero seven. So you actually have a key, doesn't it? Oh yeah, we don't have the we don't have as much speed as I have to know. in my... I don't know if I lit those in my other character. In my... On, you know what I mean. What is this? Oh, it's this fight. Crap. Yeah, I realized a bit too late that was.
I see it. challenge runs exist for this game. Yeah. Okay, 
this is a mess. save us time. Hopefully. Well, in the long run, it should. We have one level in haste, which means I'm going to put one into strength, one into dexterity. Stronger attacks, faster attacks. Harder, better, faster, stronger. Oops. up because why not?
soon we're going to have a fight over here. This fight again. Or no, never mind. Not yet. Not yet. Can't skip the cutscene. This actually does anything to the thing. Alright, that should be enough that it's noticeable. says as he picks up another magic upgrade.
here is another one. This time with an easier enemy. She's actually taking damage. She's actually getting more cracks. Fight Club.
does it... Hmm. That's... Odd. When you, uh... When you get knocked down, your attack immediately seems to point down. If you don't correct it with the stick. And I didn't think it needed to, because I was facing the other way. Oh, goodness. Sorry. Alright, let's try this again. Six silver that whole fight. Not a lot, but we'll take it. Give to a fellow crow to aid you on your quest. Can't skip it. these enemies. Alright, I mean, that could 
have been worse, he says. Okay. Sure, it's worth it. Especially if the fire actually makes the cat, which it won't, but let's pretend. Let's be hopeful. Oh, hello.
yes, this is the way to the Mushroom Kingdom. Obviously, we're in the right area now.
Happy tree friends over here. No, wait, that's not, that's not it, not at all. No, no, oh no. Why, hello, Mr. Bar.
Well, I mean, almost, right? Almost is putting in some work in the sentence. She's playing that funky music. Oh, I yep, talk to you again. No, you're the one, Unfortunately, we might have to call it before too long, just because, one, I have work in the morning, two, if, I'm, if I am actually sick, I probably do need some sleep, don't I? No reason. 
reason not to get it, I suppose. Stopping point as any, I suppose. 
Or at least it better be. Alright, so I will catch you all in the next one. Tomorrow will be, honestly, probably more Death's Door. I think I would like to finish this game. Uh, get that achievement, and then do whatever stuff happens after the credits. And we'll see how long that takes. Alright, catch you all in the tomorrow's stream, then. Bye-bye!